There are three ways to make brown. Brown is made by mixing the complements of a primary color with its complement. So the secondary that's across from it. So blue and orange, you can do green and red, or violet and yellow. So I'm going to start by making my secondary color, which is green. Each one will give you a different look. So I'm going to show you all of them. So I pull my darker color into my lighter color till I get green. Then I'm going to put its complement next to it, which is red. So I'm going to pull that red into the green. And it's going to give me kind of a, a warmer brown. The more green you have in it, the darker it will become. The next way you can do it is by mixing blue with its complement. So its complement is orange. I'm going to put red and yellow by each other. Red is the darker color, so I'm going to pull it away and go towards the orange side, sorry, the yellow side to make orange. So its complement is blue. I'm going to put that by it. And this is how you make brown using orange. It'll give you a little bit of a warmer orange and not quite so earthy. The next way you can do it is by mixing violet. If you feel confident in doing so, go ahead. But remember, violet's probably the most difficult secondary color to mix because it's a little hard to identify. So once I've got my violet, I'll have my yellow. I'm going to go ahead and pull that off to the side. This will give me a nice earthy brown. Next, you have black and white put on the plate. So I'm going to grab some black, paint that down. Paint white down on the plate. And it doesn't matter to mix it anymore because this is the last color. And you can make any value of gray that you want. As long as you mix black and white together, you'll get gray. And that's how you make any color. The different amounts of gray, black, and white will determine what value, what intensity you have with each color.